What is up everyone? Today is Tuesday, the 14th. It is Valentine's Day. Happy Valentine's Day to everyone. Hope everyone is having an amazing day. Hope everyone is feeling great. And it is the last day for the Valentine's Day event and it is the last day for all the cool spawns, uh, shiny furlishes, and the uh, event eggs for shiny furlishes as well. So hopefully you guys got a shiny furlish of both the male and female because they are both very sick and those evolutions are amazing. And we do have another little, uh, little go tour teaser right now. We do have the go tour countdown. Um, cash five Pokemon, very chill. Uh, rewards 500 Stardust, uh, 10 Great Balls, <laughs> 500 XP, and a counter with a Pokemon. Let's go ahead and knock that out and see what that encounter is with. All right, let's claim that dust and then. Grab these great balls, this XP, and a Sableye, okay. Sableye is really cool. Um, it was 750 dust per catch, that's pretty nice. Um, and it is a Hoenn Tour Pokemon. Um, I think Sableye is only good for uh, PvP. It does have a Mega, I think it's not out yet, but let's give it some dust and decent 3 star, but I think it's very good in going Great League. Uh, shadow or non-shadow, I think, maybe? Let me know in the comments if that's right or not. <laughs> and since it is the last day for the Valentine's Day event, we do have the last day for the double incense, the 30 minute daily incense. I'm gonna go ahead and put that on and see if we can get something rare or a legendary. And with that incense done, we did catch 24 Pokemon. Um, I saw a lot of Aldinos out here, uh, a lot of Aldinos, that was really nice, he had like 2,100 dust from those, that's pretty cool, and I also did see a lot of Morlulls, um, I forget that Morlulls actually give you extra dust too, they're like Paris, uh, they give you 500 dust per catch, so that was really, really cool, but yeah, so no bird today, but a few days ago we did run into the majestic and very colorful Galarian Moltres. Yes, we ran into the Galarian Moltres a few days ago. Um, I got super, super hyped. It's been a while since I've seen a Galarian bird. And, uh, you know, took my time to catch it and did a few shakes. But unsuccessful. Uh, we didn't get the job done there. But hopefully we can encounter another one soon and maybe get the job done and catch it. <laughs> but I did enjoy the 30 minute daily ascents for like, that whole week. That was really cool, I love that. Definitely you had some time to walk around. 30 minutes is a lot of time. Ran to a Glaring Bird and you know, that's pretty, pretty dope. And we also did find another cool uh, little encounter. We found the elusive uh, shiny Nidoran, my first one of the collection. It's very cool. I like they're kind of like um, they're kind of mixed matched because the Nidoran boy is like a purplish pink, and the Nidoran girl is like uh, shiny as a pink, and then um, the Nidoran boy shiny is blue like the uh, female Nidoran, so that was pretty cool, ran to that. Hopefully I can find a few more to evolve it to a Nidoqueen. That would be really cool, because I don't have that family yet. <laughs> and since today is Valentine's Day, and the last day for the Valentine's Day event, let's go ahead and get this fur fro to the heart trim. Oh yeah, it's very beautiful, very nice. Um, I love the fur fro. Definitely need the shiny version of Furfro because that shiny is very beautiful and the trims for the shiny is very amazing. Hope I can find that soon. I did not get that for this week, but when it comes back, I will be grinding hard for that. Maybe it'll be an eggs, hopefully, and I can hatch some eggs. And another little fun shiny we just got was this shiny Pidgey, and that's awesome. Really random. Uh, it's not even spawning too much for today it's still valentine's day event um found this random shiny pidgey now let's go ahead and evolve it and get that shiny pidgey family complete get this shiny pidgey all the way through to a shiny pidgeot it's been a while since i've found uh shiny pidgeys but 
finally found my third shiny. Um, I don't know if I had the community day, but hopefully uh, the Pidgeot looks really cool because I do love the shiny Pidgeotto. Let's go ahead and fall back to the Pidgeot. And Pidgeot is still the number one uh, flying type, so I think, and, and the only flying type, I think, Mega, I think. Yeah, wow. Amazing. Looks like a yellow sponge cake or something. I love it. That's awesome. Definitely looks very distinct from the original non-shiny Pidgeot. Check those IVs. IVs, two star. Not too good, but finally have the shiny Pidgey family complete. Let me guys know, do, do you guys have a lot of shiny Pidgeots? Uh, shiny Pidgeys? Do you guys have the full family? And what do you guys think about the shiny family? I hope you guys enjoyed that video. Um, thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you for all the love you guys show. And hope to see you on the next one. Take care guys. Later.